here afternoon in Texas. We have Jeremiah Bentley here from Texas Mutual, who's going to go ahead and tell us a little bit about his journey with Comp Laude. But before we dive into it, why don't you tell us a little bit about Texas Mutual? Well, thanks for asking. Texas Mutual is the largest provider of workers' comp in the state of Texas. Um, we've got about a thousand employees all across the state, and we think it's our mission to help take care of injured workers uh, after they're injured, but even better if we can do things to help prevent them from getting hurt in the first place. We think that's really uh, our role to help take care of the employers and the employees of Texas. So you're a big supporter of the Comp Laude event and have been involved for four years now? Four years, yes. Nice. Why? The first time I heard about it, it seemed like such a natural fit. I and mean, we're here to uh, do what we can to take care of folks, to really be a positive force in people's life when something happens. And that really aligns with Comp Laude because that's what it is about, is telling the story of the work comp industry and telling the story of how we help take care of workers and uh, you know make the world a better place. So because of your passion for the Comp Laude, you're on the advisory board. And in that, you're on the judging committee. So what are some of your roles in the judging committee? So the judging committee is a good place to, to be involved in the program and y'all have done a good job of putting together a large group of people who kind of shepherd this all through the process. So um, I'm about to start judging soon. Uh, and we've got a lot of background done from the nominating committee and the vetting committee. So ultimately we're gonna read the entries of all the folks that have passed those first two steps in the process, score them, and then make recommendations for the final award winners. And how do you feel about the award winners and seeing their stories and how it all plays out? I mean, one of the things that really has surprised me is how many good stories there are. So it's a hard thing to score them against each other because there's so many people doing so much good work. And then it's really exciting when we get to the event to be able to see someone that I've read about and see them in person and really uh, learn about how they've applied all the good things that they're doing. That is a fun part for me too, getting to be up on stage and then seeing them win and their surprise reactions. So that is fun. Your session was selected for the Comp Laude agenda. So why don't you tell us a little bit about your session? We're very excited to have a session that we're able to present to talk about what we're doing. Um, so when we talk to employers, the one thing they always talk about is the trouble in attracting qualified talent. And so we created a partnership with a government agency and a media company to help recruit, help them recruit and retain um, employees who are skilled on the job. So a lot of construction, manufacturing, oil and gas companies that we insure, what they really need are folks that have some education, not a college degree, community college, OSHA certificate, things like that. And we were able to create a program that helped the employees do that, which leads to more productive workers, that leads to safer workers, it leads to more economic opportunity for the employees, which leads to better customers for us. So it's a win all the way around. We're gonna love to have the chance to talk about that program. And what's the name of your session? It is called Trade Up. Nice. I'm so excited to see it. So Jeremiah and I, plus all the advisory board members, are on a journey to change the workers' compensation to a more positive narrative. For more information, go to complaudy.com. And we look forward to seeing you September 23rd through the 25th in Huntington Beach at the Pasea Hotel. See you there.